All right, welcome back. Uh, another product review, uh, which probably getting a little bit ahead of myself, but uh, I want to show you some of the essential oils that I use. Uh, essential oils that I like to use are rosemary, uh, spearmint, yes, yes. That's it. I mean, I have other ones, but uh, I've tried out orange. I don't recommend orange. I don't recommend any type of fruit uh, unless it's lemon. And lemon is just in case, you know, you want to lighten your dreads. Uh, lemon, you can put on your dreads and then it's going to dry them out. Go out into the sun, sun and it's going to dry them out even more. Uh, if you choose to take this route, make sure that you are definitely mo moisturizing your head. Uh, because if your hair gets dry, what happens? It becomes fickle and more breakage. Yeah. 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 Okay. So, uh, definitely, definitely, I like lemon uh, when it comes to coloring. If you want to color your hair uh, using, you know, the sun, uh, which to me is natural ish. <laughs> it's the closest thing you can get to natural. Uh, it's not like, you know, when you live next to a beach and you go down to the beach and get all the salt in your hair and it dries out your hair and you just have really, really sun damaged hair and it looks amazing, you know, and you're like, what? Well, I don't have a beach next to me, so can't really do that. Uh, I don't really like lavender. Uh, lavender makes me sleepy. Uh, plus it reminds me of things, so... I had to get away from the lavender, but I definitely like the lavender when it comes to different art pieces I do, which I won't reveal that just yet, so stay tuned, because you might see me slip it in there somewhere. <laughs> so anyway, uh, I do like the cinnamon. The cinnamon is really, 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 really strong, uh, and these are the now essential, essential oils. Uh, it's really, 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 really strong. Uh, be careful. Uh, you don't want to get in your eyes. You definitely don't want to get in your eyes. Uh, these say that they are edible. Uh, I have licked my fingers after them. That's about as far as I've gone. So I will say that I'm not dead yet. And I didn't get sick. So I want to say that they are edible. Yeah. So, <laughs> uh, but anyway, the orange, uh, it feels really, really sticky and stuff uh, so putting it in your hair isn't necessarily the best idea the aroma that comes with it is amazing though so I was tempted I did it I tried it I uh, wasn't too bad especially after you mix it in with the oils especially if you mix it correctly with the oils then it comes out really really awesome uh, but I feel no can't do it I uh, Rosemary, I chose because uh, it's supposed to help with growth. Uh, it's also supposed to strengthen. I think that's right. And it also, what I really like about the rosemary is that it keeps away bugs. I don't like bugs. I hate bugs. And the lavender also wait, also will help with bugs, and so will. Uh, can't remember if it's peppermint or not or it's a different it's a different one uh my favorite smell though is spearmint by far uh it's not my top one but it's my second one to go to i like smelling like spearmint uh gum people pick it up really fast and they can they go Ooh. oh and then you you kind of have a, a scent to you uh, and the, only, the main reason why I really like these is because a lot of people have a perspective of dreads being smelly, disgusting, not maintenanced very well, etc, etc, etc. And by using these, I've kind of uh, gotten away from that typical idea of what they're supposed to be. When you come around and you smell like spearmint, people go... Where's that smell coming from? And you go your hair, and then their perspective of your hair becomes 100% different. And it only adds to who you are. Uh, 
I don't feel like it takes away from you at, at all. If there was a, a like a, a different way, like maybe if I go out and buy a bunch of spearmint leaves and kind of like put my hair in it and water and kind of just sit it down and do it that way, <laughs> I would at least try it, you know. But since there's not, uh, I kind of like just using the essence oils. I uh, and again. I don't do it very often. I might do it maybe uh, once every blue moon, depending on if you know you go out on a date or if I'm like going to try to impress somebody for a job interview. Uh, I might wear it and use it as a talking point or a way to lead into talking about my hair and why I chose what I chose to do. Uh, sorry, I'm working on peace again. You know me, every video I gotta work on something. I, I just can't sit still for some reason. But I'm trying to give you all my attention now and I'm trying to speak like I am extremely excited, you know, because I don't wanna keep killing y'all with those doll videos. And I wanna keep you entertained, I wanna keep you here and I wanna keep you engaged. So anyway. I recommend these and you will find them in the description and it'll be linked there to Amazon. Now, if you haven't gotten a shirt yet, this is not my shirt and I'm still waiting on my shirts to come in, but I've ordered them. So go out there, get you a shirt by me, uh, easykios.com. That's E-Z-I-K-I-O-S-K.com. It's easy to help yourself. I know, I know, just so slick. I uh, like and subscribe please uh, and I'll see you at the next one